So this is my second morning in Coffee Bay and I'm really being treated to a fantastic sunrise in the east and watch this that's Coffee Bay down below and up on the hill but look at that moon set in the west how often do you see that the moon going down on one side and the sun coming up on the other goodbye moon hello sun what our uh, campsite looks like at Coffee Bay. Um, caravan's way at the back there, almost in the forest. There are a lot of mosquitoes uh, in the morning and evening, so that's why Ying Ying has brought the table right out here to eat her breakfast, uh, away from the mosquitoes. And here you see the new favorite pet dog called Snowy. Well. That is not necessarily the dog's name, but Meme just christened the dog Snowy this morning. We don't know where the dog came from, but Meme is convinced that it's hers for life now. Let's take a look at what Vivian's having for breakfast. Her first breakfast in Coffee Bay. It might shock most viewers, but there it is. Avo, one kind of salty biscuit and another kind of salty biscuit with bovril. A fried Snowy. egg Snowy. and a bowl Snowy. of cereal. Snowy. This is what I'm having for breakfast. A bowl of chicken soup because I had a rough night last night and drank a little bit too much. Already had some. Tomorrow. Here are the kids um, looking at the wares of a crayfish seller. It's Alfred. His name's Alfred and he is trying to sell us these crayfish. The problem is we already have a lot of crayfish and these ones look too small as well. I just want to show you uh, the route from our caravan to the beach. Go down this short path, run kids run. You can go faster than that, come on. Run! And then we turn the corner, uh -oh. and there's the sea. Baba, are you ready? And then after we come out of the gate uh, for the caravan park, we take a small walk down that grassy track, and we get to a river mouth down there. And just around the corner is where you find the backpackers. So here's the river mouth and if you look up the river you can see the first of the backpackers that one's called Coffee Shack and there's one or two others uh, up the river or up the hill. So we've just crossed the river and now we're gonna go up the hill. So that's the sign of the Bom Vu Hostel. And as you walk up the hill, uh, there's a shop on your left. It's the only shop that I've come across in Coffee Bay. Um, no fresh food of any sort, but it does have a lot of junk food and canned food. We forgot to bring any water on this little trip, so now they blackmailed me into buying Coke or Sprite or something. So this is the only shop that I've found. There might be more and it's a bit run down but it does have junk food. It's owned by uh, Bangladeshis or Pakistanis or I'm not sure who. So let's go in and see what we can find to drink. I think Mei Mei is going to be a vet because I've never known anyone more obsessed 
with animals. Um. <laughs> Jesse, what are you going to be when you grow up? He still likes me. I don't know. Does he like you, Meme? Jesse is going to be a movie maker or something. He's going to make movies with lots of soldiers and dinosaurs. And guys, you've already forgotten why we're here. That's why we're here. Wow, look at all that. Lots and lots of maize meal to make millipup. And where are the Coca-Colas? There's the Coca-Cola, Jesse May May. You need a Coke. These are the goats coming to eat the rubbish that has just been swept out of the shop. Come on, eat, eat, eat. There you go. Oh, it's going to be delicious. Yum, 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 yum.你刚才会冲浪了，你觉得你很厉害吗？很厉害。你好厉害哦，是谁教你冲浪的？呃，我我觉得会冲浪。你你会冲浪，谁教你冲浪的？啊，那是可能他他有，是的，是的。啊啊